Uh, okay, uh, I was black and uh, I chose some uh, Ragozin variation, uh, some sharp, sharp uh, with H6G5, so it means that it will be with maybe without castle, so very sharp vari variation. Uh, but then I thought I, I was uh, mixed up some some moves and uh, I was worse, I think. But uh, maybe she wasn't precise, uh, pl play good, and uh, I equalized. So then uh, it was equal, 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 but I was low on the time, very much. So I was inside, not already, I don't know, I has five minutes against 50. Uh, so, well, we started uh, our... Calculations, you know, she pushed f4 in the center. I don't know, I took and it was equal, I thought, but uh, okay, I, I was uh, satisfied with my position then. I don't know, and inside not she, she blundered, maybe, I don't know what, what happened. <laughs> so, as I know, we are second place now, yeah, I don't know, I'm just not sure. But of course, uh, we are just searching for medal. <laughs> Ukraine beat Russia, so probably we will have, have some chances to fight. I mean, not just like the tournament is already finished. Uh, but I mean, our team, there's still one player playing and uh, her game is, right now is a kind of worse. So we hope that if she can save this game, so we will fight until the last round. Generally, it's fine except the game with Russia, with Katya Nagno, because that game I played just a very horrible start from the very beginning. Not only I'm not satisfied with the result, but only also with the game's quality, because it's a lot like a real game. And also it influenced my team's result, so I'm kind of upset for that. And besides this one, the other games are fine. Okay, for chess players, sometimes you just feel that you're not in a very good shape. And uh, But this blunder appear just shocked me because it's not difficult, you know. Anyway, we will try our best for the final round.